Hello and welcome to Time Series Forecasting. In this video, I'm going to continue talking about how to select uh, predictors based on uh, adjusted R squared AIC. And in this video, I'm going to extend the concept uh, by including AIC corrected. So the problem with the AIC that I talked uh, previously is that if our time span is too short, that is our data set is not long enough, then AIC tends to select too many predictors. For example, we may have uh, 10 potential predictors and AIC may select uh, 5 of them as our best uh, predictors. But the original model may only contain uh, 3 variables. So we probably need to correct our AIC so that uh, we can uh, take care of this problem by correcting our AIC. So what we do here is uh, we correct our AIC by using uh, this adjustment in AIC and we call the resulting uh, criterion AIC corrected and essentially again we will choose a model which will give us uh, a minimum value of uh, this criterion as well because essentially this criterion also contains AIC in it and remember this contained uh, sum of squared residuals in it hence uh, we want to minimize uh, uh, this error as well. So again we will choose a model which will give us some minimum uh, AIC corrected. Alright so this was the third uh, way of uh, selecting predictors. In the next video I'm going to talk about uh, our fourth uh, measure that we can use to select uh, predictors.